Hey everybody, <clears throat> this will be back again. Um, I'm here to show you the phonics activity that you can do at home to help reinforce the long vowel sounds when you're using your vowel teams. So I have the vowel teams written down that we're going to concentrate on today. We have EA, which says E. We have OW, which is going to say O today. We have AI, which is going to say A. AY, which is also going to say AY. I mean AY, which is also going to say A as well, I'm sorry. And E, e, which is going to say E, okay? So again, just to reinforce that, you can always think when two vowels go walking, the first one does the talking, the second one is silent, or the second one goes out for T, so you don't hear that second vowel right away. So in a word, in a word like beach, let's say, B-E-A-C-H, you hear the B, E, ch, beach, B-E-A-C-H. So the A is silent. B, B, E, ch, beach, right? So, <clears throat> and then O, W is going to say O today. A, I is going to say A. A, Y is going to say A. And E, E will say E. So we want to concentrate on the long vowel sound. Again, that's something that we've been working on a lot. And if we can get that down and we're reading words, it's going to open up a whole ton of more words that we can read and we can understand. It's going to make our reading and writing even better than it already is. So what I did today is I took <clears throat> I took a piece of paper. I took three pieces of paper right here, okay? So I took a paper, I folded it into thirds, okay, like so. And then I folded it down into fourths. So it's gonna make a total of 12 boxes. So I wrote down a bunch of words <clears throat> that have the long vowel sound there to help challenge them. So here, just to show you what some of the words I have. I have cream, bead, grown, stow, low, grow, show, main, day, stain, chain, stray. So look at that word chain, chain right there. You see the CH sounds together. Ch. AI is going to say A and then the N sound at the end. N. Ch. A. N. Chain. Okay? So that's one way to think about it. And we're going to make a card game that you can play at home with a partner. So it's going to be a little bit weird playing with myself, but that's what we do. So we're going to take those cards. I'm going to fold them. I'm going to cut them up. Okay. Now you can make, I only made three sheets just, you know, for the sake of the video. But you can brainstorm as many of the long vowel team words as you can. You can make up a game that you can play with, you know, one person, more than one person, just trying to, you know, reinforce those vowel sounds so we can read and write even more words that we already know. Okay, so it's kind of a fun game, and it's kind of similar to Go Fish, but, you know, we'll show you how to play it and try to go through a couple rounds to see how we go from there. But the more words that you know, the better. So you can always reach out, ask for like maybe a 100 word list or a 200 word list. I'll help you get those um, as well. The more high frequency words we can know, the better, but <clears throat> knowing these vowel sound patterns is even better. So we're going to take our stack of cards here. We're going to shuffle them up. Okay. So they shuffle up from there. Okay. There goes one. Tough shuffling with paper, but you know, <clears throat> right now since we're home, we're doing the best we can, and we're figuring it out. So it's all about, you know, just trying new things. So I'm going to lay the cards face down right here, okay? I'm going to take one, two, three, four, five. And then another player would get five, and if you're playing with more than one person, the next person would get five as well, okay? So we go from there. I'm going to put that right there so you can see that. Okay, so I'm going to take my five cards. Now, I'm going to show you what I have for the sake of the game here, but <clears throat> we want to try to make as many match pairs as we can. So I have stray. I have gray. I have dream. Okay, that's a long E. I have beam which is another long E, and I have stay, 
Now, if you have a Valentine match, <clears throat> okay, you can go. From, you can put them down right away. So I'm gonna go with Gray. I see the A Y there, and Stray. So that has the same vowel sound. I'm gonna put those down over here, so I know that I have that's my match. Okay. I also have the long E sound. I have Dream, and I have Bean. So I'm almost out of I'm almost out of cards, which is kind of the point of the game. So I have stay. Now I could ask my partner, um, do you have some do you have a long A sound? Now they might have AI or they might have AY, so who knows? But I'm gonna take a card, okay? And I have I got peak. Okay? So somebody able to go again, I have to go away and make another match. Okay? I'm going to take another card. Huh. There we go. This time I got clay. So now I made a match. So I'm keeping on making my long vowel sound matches as we go. So this is just a fun little game to play to reinforce the um, long vowel sounds. Again, really concentrating on it. You know, there's not, a, there's not a magic way to do it, but if you can brainstorm a bunch of, you know, words with the... EA with OW, with AI, with AY, with EE, and you can make your cards. The more cards you can make, the more you can play, the better you're going to get at reading and writing. So, boys and girls, parents, thanks a lot for watching. Keep practicing those long vowel sound words. Um, hope everybody's doing well and being safe. I'll talk to you again soon.